Libra. What's up? What's good? What's happening? Welcome in. Welcome back. Um, I didn't realize I stopped on Libra. I have literally never. I've been reading for, what, four years, five years? I have never stopped on Libra. What? Anyways, if it fits, take it. If not, try a different message. Um, I hope everyone here is doing well. Let's get into it, Libra. I cannot believe. I just looked down. I'm like, all right, who are we on? I've been farting around this morning. I'm taking my time. Um, obviously, I'm still in my comfy PJs. Check it out. <laughs> I'm so ready. Look, we're doing it. We're doing it. Hocus Pocus Tarot. What do we have for Libra? We're going to do a Celtic cross spread. I've had too much coffee this morning. Oh, well. Current energy for Libra. Please and thank you. Ooh, I got the smiles, Libra. I got the smiles. It's our birthday season, isn't it? It's 22nd. Happy birthday, Libras. The five of pumpkins. Ooh. Hmm. Why the five of pentacles? Hmm. What's crossing? Ooh. Two of lightning. Is this like something you didn't see coming and you feel like you are going to lose your balance? This is like having the rug swept from under you. This is not having a leg to stand on. <clears throat> Feeling like you don't have what you need and something comes in, you just, you literally don't know what to do. Um... Don't make purchases unless you need to right now. If you guys are going through like some financial things. Because you kind of have the money for it, but you don't know for sure. Don't do it. Don't do it. Something, this could be like a bad sale as well. Maybe you're like putting money into something and it breaks right away. Now you don't even know what to do. Especially if this is like a private buyer. There's no like a store receipt and return policy for you here. Um, I don't know. I don't know. People are going to start spending money on these holidays coming up. And so like this, that could be what this is too. What is this? Ace of candles in reverse in your foundation. I was all smiles when I started this, but like y'all are, what is this? Lack of inspiration no drive, no, no passion. Like, what is the foundation here? This is not fertile soil. This is not Libra's reading. This is not you. There's no way this is you. Recent past, king of lightning in reverse. They're all coming out reverse now. That's the fastest moving king in reverse. That is truthful communication in reverse. This is chaos. The emperor at the bottom of the deck. Libra, why? What is this? Is this a fluke? Do I need to start over three, four, five on the time, though? Uh, it feels like I need to keep going. Knight of Wands and Strength. So is this your energy? Or do you really need to, like, you need a kick in the fucking pants right now to put you back into overdrive? Yeah, because some of you guys, King of Cups and the Fool card, we need your heart in this, Libra. Your heart's not in something. Or maybe somebody else needs a spark of inspiration and you're the one that's got it. Oh my gosh, I get it, I get it. Y'all had me panicking. I never pull something like that for a Libra before. I don't want to start now. Yeah, the hermit. Somebody's stuck in hermit mode and you're the Herald font that they're seeking answers from. Ten of potions is cups and the page. Yeah, you have access to this and I have questions. How do I get there? This is a page um, asking the king of potions, the page of potions and king. You are the king. 
All right, and there's a fool, meaning somebody that doesn't know, that's asking you for these questions. This is somebody that's been in hermit mode, though, so you haven't spoke with this person in a while. All right, this may have already happened, or this is all in the mind space, mind you. So this could be somebody who is, um, you're going to know before this person comes in. Maybe you're thinking about somebody. You've been thinking about somebody that's di distant past, and you're like, why are they crossing my mind now? Like, that's weird. Um, this is why. Because they're about to approach you, and you're, you're picking up on that. They're reaching out to your energy, and you might not be sure why. This person is lacking something. There's things they don't know. Alpha, get off the counter. I see you. I'm not sleeping right now. I'm right here making noise. Yes, hi. I, I oh. <laughs> yes, hi. Say hi to the people. Hello, Libras. Hello. He's going to grace you with his presence as a birthday present. Um... <laughs> Have a seat. Go ahead. Sit. Sit. He got in trouble last night, so he's sucking up. All right, let's see. <clears throat> Near future, what do we have for Libra? Please and thank you. You know, it's interesting how I mentioned somebody might be coming back and then my cat comes and sits in my lap. They do that when they're trying to protect you. We have suspension at the bottom of the deck. Here's the sun card. Yeah, it's going to make a lot more sense here in a minute. Somebody is stuck and looking for transformation. And you are the queen of... Po yeah, see, you you are the one. They're, they're hoping that you're going to be open-hearted, open-minded, and help them. Why is the two pumpkins in reverse? Ooh, that's interesting because I don't put the cards in here reversed. And then he goes back to the counter. Alpha... You twit. That has to do with this. Because that's not normal. He don't do that right in front of me. Especially right after I told him not to. I mean, he does, but like... When he's sucking up, he does that. Something's weird. Somebody's gonna... Two of pumpkins in reverse. I feel like you, I feel like the divine wants you to help this person and you're kind of smirking because it's funny how some of you guys, this person, all Libra, you have this really subtle way to tell people, fuck you, but in the most loving way possible. And I think I'm starting to understand now why my coworkers laughed every time I took an irate customer service call for any place that I worked. Um, I get it now why I became manager at a lot of these places, because this makes sense. So, like, if somebody did you wrong, you understand that they're not receiving their karma. And there's not much more you can do other than point them in the right direction. That's all you can do is point somebody in the right direction. If they choose to take it, cool. If they don't take your advice, well, I mean, it's their choice. All, all I can do is say, hey, well, maybe give this a try. And if they do, bye-bye, <laughs> right? Cool, good for you, awesome. Um, you're not in any way, shape, or form needing to help this person, but if you should take it upon yourself to help them, you already know whether they take the advice or not, this is you truly healing. This is what true healing looks like. Not holding the grudge and saying, fuck you, man, deal with it. I mean, you can, honestly. Honestly, because you don't owe this person nothing, right? So if it was that bad and that's where you're at, don't let negative thoughts tell you that that's wrong because it's not. You do not owe this person. I want to be very clear on that. Um, but if you should help them, you know that when you help, help comes back. Or when you do good, good comes back. Like... So if you can find it within you to do that, definitely without overgiving or explaining, for some of you, this person, there was trauma. 
um, and you over explain now because of this. This would be narcissistic um, abuse. That right there, that's something people don't talk about enough, actually. But <clears throat> should you find yourself able to do that, it would be very big of you. And also a little bit, <laughs> your shadow is going to smirk, okay? That's all I'm going to say. Just don't eat that up too much and you're fine. Fears, worries, concerns is the two of candles. Should I stay or should I go? Should I, what should I do? It's up to you. It, it's up to you, really, really. As long as you're not doing it to be mean, vindictive, get this person back, purposely laugh in their face, right? It's wrong to want somebody to come back just so you could slam the door in their face. Um, but if they come to you asking for help, that's different. That's different. Because they came to you. Not you, like... Anyways, anyways. Um, how's the divine viewing all this? For Libra... Whew, too much coffee. <laughs> Ooh... Yeah, somebody's having a nightmare. It's a nightmare for them. It's a nightmare for them. I just heard they might ask you to read for them. Please do it. But be honest. Tell them what you see. They're coming to you for answers. Charge them the same amount you charge anybody else. I mean, it's just like anything else, right? reading for him. Fuck it. They're already scared to approach you because they feel like you already know they're coming. This person may have verbally denied you your gifts and abilities, but believe me, they know you're the real deal. And you struggled with that a lot. That shit echoed in your head, in your heart. What's the goal? The four of potions. This is a test. You're being tested, Libra. The goal is to have you to have someone six of candles. Oh, that makes sense. With the nine of candles, that, okay, yeah. Somebody's wounded and they're looking for balance. They're looking for success and victory and help. They also kind of want to patch things up with you a little bit here, but um, again, they're not even sure if you're going to hear them out, if you're going to be open to this. They're hoping you will, but they're not expecting it. But they're hurt. They're hurting. Nine of Wands. They're wounded. They're hurting. They're going through some shit. I don't think it's between you and them, though. I think it's between them and someone else. Although the stuff that you guys had, it's going to come up. Oh, I felt that. Yeah, because for some of you, you don't want this to be an option. I was just looking at the two of pumpkins here. You're like, no, get out. Some of you guys are telling this person, get out, go. Your kind, as in your exes, are not welcome here. Like, people that you've booted out for a reason, they're not welcome here. That's that's this person's falling under that category, and those people are not... No. Yeah, some of you guys... Um, oh, you feel very strongly about that. You don't go back to exes. There were a couple of them that you did, but never again. 
Three of Swords, yep. And Pentacles. With the Queen of Pentacles, because yeah, you know your worth, you know your value. Step up or step out. You don't owe this person anything. That's all I'm going to say. If you should choose to help them, of course there's going to be blessings in it for you. It's just, it's up to you, really. Eight of Lightning. Yeah, move how you want to move. You already know. Life is going to speed up. You're going to get a lot more downloads about this, too. For some of you guys, this isn't fully making sense right now. It will. Yeah, the tower. I keep saying people are going to be surprised. People are going to be shocked. It's really up to you, though. Somebody is going through some stuff, and they need your help. They need your help. It could be spiritually. It could be financially. Um, this could be a lot. It could even be like a family member is um, being attacked ostracized could be relationship issues this could be a lot the queen of potions could be um this could even be like therapy counseling um a mediator somebody that you guys go to to vent or relationship advice parents even I mean, we do have the Fool and the Herald font. This could literally be anybody. Whoever it is, I don't think they're necessarily spiritually studied. That's why they're coming to you, because they know that you know things. It's in their life. It's not like they're dealing with ghosts in their house or, or paranormal activity. It at some place it's not like that this is their life is falling apart they're losing their job they're getting kicked out of their house they're having vehicle problems um there could be repossessions here bankruptcy there's the i mean it's fucking major loss this is crazy it's so much loss or it's such a big loss that they literally do not know what to do i have no idea what to do Wow. It's up to you. Um, we got Taurus, Aries, Cancer, Scorpio, Leo, Virgo. I pulled a lot of cards here. Aquarius, Scorpio, Pisces, Leo, and Scorpio. I'll see you guys next time. Until then, stay beautiful.